Hello YouTube and welcome to lesson 25 of the Adobe Illustrator tutorial series. So today we're going to look at how to align objects inside of Adobe Illustrator. So once you have multiple objects over here inside of Illustrator, then you don't actually have uh, much idea about the spacing over here. So let me just actually copy and paste the same shape so it is the same size over here. So I have a bunch of shapes just like this, just scattered around uh, without the knowledge of actually the separation. So I'm going to select all of the text, all of the shape over here and then go over here to windows and then align. Actually, this actually appears over here at the top by default, but if you go to align, then you're actually uh, presented with the small box over here. The same option is available over here as well. So right now in the align option, if you were to see this, there's the whole horizontal align in the first go. So if I were to click it, you can see that it actually um, does not change the distance of the height, uh, that is the vertical spacing, but only the left spacing, and it'll keep the first shape as its uh, alignment. So it will actually left align and uh, does the horizontal alignment to the left and brings all the shape onto the left and does not actually change the vertical axis. And this one is the center alignment. So if I were to do this, then it will actually uh, take the average of the overall shape and then will center align everything else. And this one is the right align. So there's the left, center and right. If I were to press this, then this will actually top align this and it'll change the uh, y axis instead of the x axis this is the center align and bottom align just like that this one is this distribution over here so this will actually distribute the uh, vertical space equally so if i were to left align and press the distribution you can see that the distribution becomes equal if i were to press this then it'll actually distribute from the center point since i'm using a circle there's no point of using this uh, so this actually works if you are using the anchor point tool. So if you were to use this, let's say for example, I'm going to use the anchor point at the bottom, um, then it will actually al align to the anchor point. Let's, so let me just use another option right here, like this one, just like this. Let me select this, uh, all of these, and then go to uh, align, and then center align this. And you can see that this actually changes the certain portion of the shape. So it doesn't, does not actually work with shapes like oval and stuff. So if you, this is the bottommost part, it'll actually uh, squeeze it down to the bottom a bit, center a bit, and then top a bit. So this is uh, similarly, uh, the, 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 these are, can be used to align um, the shapes. So if I were to increase the size of the shapes, you can see that I can align it like this. All right, so I can actually uh, uh, left align this, I can actually do uh, center align this as well. So it actually changes it a bit to the center. That's the center portion over here. Um, so this is how it actually affects the align shape. So I can um, quickly align the objects inside of Adobe Illustrator by using the align tool inside of Adobe Illustrator. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.